especially with the amount of lucky moments going on within Roblox stores, there's gotta be even crazier unlucky moments within the game as well, right? Well, these are even unluckier moments inside Roblox doors. Comment below your unluckiest moment, and you better like and subscribe to stay lucky. Whenever the lights are flickering on and off, that's your cue to hide as fast as possible before Rush or Ambush makes their way. But this player had two special guest visits. You freaking kidding me? Jack decided to swing by not once, but twice in a row, causing the player to lose. That's just unfortunate, buddy. Though, it was a 1 out of 400 chance, crazily enough. This player was also trying to run away from Rush, but they were even more unluckier, crazily enough. Not only did they get two jacks in a row before Rush again, but these ones were in separate closets, which was even more insane. Imagine getting three in a row though. That would be just way too many jacks right there, man. But enough with the jacks. This is gonna be the craziest Rush moment I've ever seen in Doors, man. Check this out. I'm gonna be honest, I didn't know that was a thing. Two rushes in a row in the courtyard. Basically what happened was that the first rush opened up the next couple doors after the courtyard, which ended up spawning another right behind. But being in the courtyard, there's nowhere to hide, causing an unfortunate game over for the player. I've never seen that before, believe it or not. Whenever a figure gets stuck inside of the library, it always gives you such a great feeling to know how easy it would be to solve the puzzle and move on to the next room. But things didn't go to plan for this player. He's just stuck! <laughs> if I run, will he get unstuck? Yes, 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 yes. Okay, well, you know what? That's kind of just... Yeah, they got too cheeky, but they were also unlucky to go on the opposite side, causing figure to get unstuck and catching them. But imagine trying to do a world record speed run and being 11 minutes into your run, but then the impossible happens. Yeah, I, 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 don't, I don't think it was that funny. <laughs> Again, Jack, why do you have to be such a nuisance? Especially 11 minutes into a speedrun like that, I would be mad if that happened, no cap. Instead of running into Jack though, what if you ran into Glitch instead and they greeted you by yeeting you straight into an incoming rush with literally no time to hide? Yeah, that actually happened. I feel so bad for the player, man. Glitch didn't give him any time at all to even breathe, let alone hide. That's so mean right there. Many players already know that Ambush can spawn in early, especially as early as door 6 in the rarest cases. But you do have that insanely unlucky chance of having the entity spawning in even sooner. We're so good, we're so good. Is that already rough? Bubba It's Ambush. What? What? Ambush door Timothy five? in first room and then ambush. They took the word right out of my mouth. Getting ambush at door 5 is so unlucky that Creecraft would literally give you a big shout out. Like come on, please, make that happen bro. Speaking about Creecraft, we all know that his game is currently broken with tons of eyes infested all over the place. But this player also ended up getting three eyes in a row, one of which in a pretty rare room. Two eyes in a row, two eyes in a row. Shut the room back there. Oh, oh there's two eyes in a row. Whoa. Like, there were two eyes in a row. No, unfortunately, Yeah, poor kid. It was their first time getting eyes too due to the achievement that they got 
but the last one was inside the puzzle room too, which they ended up getting oofed. It's common sense at this point to know how to get past figure at the end, especially if you want to skip all the heartbeat mini game shenanigans and whatnot. But what the heck happened here? finally learn how to get up that staircase and capture players through walls? And it's even worse because it happened at the end of the game, literally wasting 20 minutes of the player's time, which sucks, not going to lie. This guy also had the unfortunate time of running into eyes as early as door 5. Yeah, I don't know what was unluckier, you finding eyes so early or taking damage from them <laughs> for shame. Definitely a buggy moment, but Halt usually always shows up within their hallway that is long and narrow, perfect for stopping on a dime in order to deal with the entity. But not in a gated room like this, bro. Come on, game. You gotta work with the players, not against them. Luckily, the player didn't take too much damage, though their health isn't looking good at the moment. Everyone knows how door 100 is supposed to look like in play, but, uh, lol, what? Uh, guys, this is a very weird recording. I'm playing joints with my friend, and, uh, why is the house here? Like, this is door 100, and the house is literally right here. Like, I'm stuck. I think I'm stuck in here. Yeah, this is I, weird. I, I'm, I'm stuck. My guy, I think he got trolled hard by the servers, unfortunately. That's super unlucky, considering you have to quit the game at door 100, though. RIP in the comments, that stinks. When you're casually going through the rooms within Roblox doors, and then you randomly get teleported in between the walls of the game, basically causing you to get soft lock within the run. Yep, might as well take this L and move on to the next game, sadly enough. But imagine getting all the way to the end of the game, right at door 100, and then you end up meeting one of the newest troll entities in the whole entire game. Yeah, this one's crazy. If that's legit, that's gotta be one of the most unluckiest moments I've ever seen. But what do you guys think? Make sure you subscribe, and we'll see you next time.